this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome back to Boss Time! I'm Let's Play Final Fantasy IV Pixel against Kanyazo, the Lord of Water. Now, at the start of the battle, he's weak to ice! So, I want to hit him with that when I can. When you get him below 700 HP, he retreats into his shell so that he can well, heal himself, and it also gives him a lot of evasion for some reason. But all right, yeah, he is not more powerful than Skarmeleon. No, he's really, really easy there. If you let him live long enough, though, he can surround himself with water, and then he switches his elemental weakness to lightning instead of ice. So if that happens, I would recommend casting a quick thunder spell to remove the water, before he can hit you with a tsunami for massive damage. But all right, so we got him, lots of money. I mean, he is a king after all. Kind of ironic that the air force of the world was led by Fiend of Water though. Who's there? Hey, hey! Sid, what's going on? Where were you all this time? I don't think they ever explain that. But in any case, we're all back. Oh, yeah, just got some new threads. And armor and sword and all that. Oh, well, she's... I would hope she's still alive. But, uh, or that, yeah. Well, King kind of kicked my ass and then shoved the lightning bolt up my friend's asses. Well, yeah, that's what he does. Oh, yeah, you, you got a whole bunch of them, don't you? Ha ha. I'm a man! I'm 40! Nah, nah. I mean, your hair hasn't started turning gray yet, though. Oh, yeah, I suppose you wouldn't know, Yang, huh? Well, both of the twins, but yeah. Ha ha ha! What do you think you're gonna do? Six-year-olds to save the world? <laughs> ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Come on, whack him upside the head! Nah, she's not gonna do it this time. Evidently, I mean, yeah. Yeah, you got him all around, don't you? Right in front of us? Y we know! We Yeah! Ha ha ha! I like Sid's banter. <laughs> But, uh, all right, let's get out of here. Up. Uh, whoa, whoa, why'd the lights get all dim all of a sudden? Whoa, what do you mean? But you're dead. We killed you. Whoa. What about the walls? Game? Whoa. A locked door! My greatest weakness! Whatever shall we do? Uh, huh? What's going on? Dudes? What do you mean? Die? What are they gonna do? Oh, yeah, that would be a bummer. Ready for what? Whoa! Well, that's their uh, petrification spell. They call it break for some reason. Can we heal them? Hey, hey all right. Huh. That didn't work? Oh, okay. 
If only there were a way we could actually cure them, even with that, but apparently not. Oh. Well, maybe you could have used that meteor spell to break down the doors. But then that would probably kill him in the process anyway. Yeah, let's go! Where are we gonna go anyway? Uh-oh. Well, you know what that means. Oh, well, that was mostly Tella getting the job done, but yeah. Well, what do you mean? Why would I get the crystal for you? Oh, yeah. Maybe that's why they kidnapped her in the first place. Hmm. Well, where are you, anyway? Oh, well, yeah, you nearly killed me last time. Kind of hard to hit you when you're up in the air like that. What's going on? Well, that's what I always say. Hey, hey a secret passage! Well, this wasn't exactly in plain sight. We couldn't have done anything over there if we went there beforehand. But, in any case... Yeah, we got a new airship. It's a little early in the Final Fantasy game to get the airship, but I'll take it. Well, not as early as the last game. But still, pretty early. So, where is this thing? Like an underground hangar or something? I guess. Where do they put all the airships anyway? Uh-oh. They spotted us already? How do they always know where we are? It's like they know everything that's happened before it happens. Oh. You mean they wish to surrender to me? Very well, I accept. Oh. Yeah. No thanks to you. Oh, why can't you guys just get the crystal? Oh, okay, how? No, no, you're gonna know when I get it anyway. I was gonna say, how should we, like, call you or something? That's... So what is their airship, like, manned by monsters or something? Well, something's going on. Not. So, yeah, in order to progress with the plot, we can go northwest to Troya. Or, well, we don't have really side quests to do, but we have other stuff in the world that we can do, including right around here. But all right, another achievement there. Awesome. But yeah, now we've got more party members with Sid, who, yeah, is stuck with not very good equipment at the moment. But, man, that's pretty terrible equipment there. It's like torture. Just put on some clothes and you can't fall asleep. Holy cow. But yeah, we're going to be getting some stuff for him in the very near future. For now, let's head on back into the castle where everyone is back for some reason. I don't know where everyone else went or what was going on. I don't think they ever explain it. Well, yeah, he's kind of dead. That's usually tragic for most people. Oh, well... Thank you. 
I thought they were all trying to take over the world, though. Man, you guys didn't even see that. You're mages. Holy cow. Oh, really? Well, then what about all those warriors and generals that we've been fighting? Hmm? What are you... You shouldn't be able to cast that. That's a white magic spell. Well, fortunately, we can just toggle it. And by the way, with the toad and piggy spells in this version of the game, you not only can cast those spells alone, but you can also cast Asuna as well, even while you're a toad, unlike previous versions. So that's pretty nice. Not that I would ever want to do that because it's so expensive, but it, that is another way you could deal with that. Hmm, evidently. Oh, well, yeah, they're out there. We got someone who can cast it. So, yeah, I don't know what everyone is doing here. Maybe it was like a Hargon's Castle illusion something that was preventing us from seeing or interacting with these guys. I don't know. Oh, sure, why not? I mean, I've got to save the world and all that, but yeah. Well, maybe. A little late for that now. Oh, well, yeah, you probably wouldn't want to face him now anyway. Well, at least this place is okay now. What happens if I uh, try to cure them this way? Oh, okay. Well, it does consume your gold needle there. Whoops. But, uh, yeah, we can't do anything with them. They're as good as dead. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, I'm sure this will be the last time. Well, let's see what's going on at the barracks there. Maybe some of the... Other soldiers can tell us what's going on here. Oh, we could pay a visit to the the jail as well. Although I don't think there's anyone there to talk to now. Double check that. Oh, well, we got the one. Oh, yeah, I suppose. Maybe they just sent the mages home back through the Devil's Road or something. Let's see, do I need... Yeah, I do need to heal up, so I'll stop off at Cecil's room there soon. What else do we got? Oh, yeah, it's the hair. I know. Oh, well, why not you guys? Don't you guys have, like, generals or something? What do you mean? Don't you have a fleet of them? Well, yeah, I know that. Well, I guess he... Took the airships along with them or something. Maybe they, uh, maybe all the soldiers here were, like, trying to stop Golbez from taking the airships. So they were all out, and then by the time we defeated Kanyazo, they came back or something. I don't know. I have no evidence to support any theory as to why the castle was nearly empty before... But in any case, it's all back to normal, I guess. Oh, yeah, there was that little barrier, or whatever that thing was we ran into before in the basement there. So, yeah, why don't we check that out, too? What's going on here? Oh, maybe. Hmm, maybe we should check that out. I didn't hear anything when I was down there. Oh, yeah, if you didn't get the treasure here, yeah, you could go over there to do that, but I already got that, so I'm not worried about it. Oh, I think he's talking to Sid there or something. Oh, yeah, so he is. See, can I even cast teleport to get out of here? Nope, we're going to have to walk out. Oh, well. But anyway, once you defeat Kanyazo... Yeah, you can pass on through. And what do we got down here? A secret throne room? Who's 
who's there? I don't see anyone. Oh, there you go. Oh, okay, yeah. How do I get there? You're not gonna tell us, are you? Maybe he means the town of mist? No, no, that's not what he means. But in any case, yeah, you wanna make sure you come down here to talk to him? Uh, if I recall correctly, that activates a sequence trigger way later in the game. But for now, okay, that's everything we can do here. Let's see how those recent boss fights would go in the Super Nintendo version of the game. Okay, we're back in the Super Nintendo version of the game, just before meeting with Bagan. Or Bygan, or however you pronounce his name. Oh, well, yeah, I suppose they would have been in different branches of the military. I mean, Bagan is, uh, you know, captain of the guards here, and that's, you know, I guess they're infantry. And Golbez is in charge of the, well, the Red Wings, the Air Force, or whatever's going on. Well, why'd the music cut out? What smells? I mean, we've kind of been in a lot of bloody battles up to this point. Ha ha! What kind of gift? Boss time! Now this fight is similar to the pixel version of the game, but there are some changes here. So let's see what we can do. So with the dancing dagger, I want to use that on the left arm there to take that out. And then I want to use slow on the other arm there. The reason is because I want to defeat the body before the right arm, because if you defeat the two arms and Bagan is still there, he'll be able to regenerate them. And then, let's see, let's get Tella to do his thing there. And yeah, when you cast magic on him, he casts wall on just himself, though, not the arm. Unlike the, uh, what is it, the pixel version of the game there. And the dancing dagger can work around wall as well there. So that's pretty nice. I think that's his best source of damage there without leveling up to, I think, 23 in order to learn Quake. But in any case, yeah, let's just keep going after the body there. And yeah, the, the reason why... Oh, nah, no, I don't want to use that with wall on my own party members. But yeah, I just wanted to slow down the right arm there. So that way... Where is it? Okay, good. So that way I have time to kill it before it will explode you and it'll deal a lot of damage. However much HP it has left there, it will do. But alright, got him. So yeah, the Dancing Dagger definitely gives us quite a few options in that fight that we don't have in the pixel version there. easy enough. Now, in this version of the game, let's see, we want to remove all equipment from the twins because they're not going to automatically remove it for us after the next boss fight there. So let's get all that out of the way. If you want to leave stuff on them, though, really the only equipment that I really care about on them are the dancing dagger and the tiara there. Those two will have a lot of use throughout the game, at least in this version, with the dancing dagger anyway. But anyway, get that all out of the way. I am not extraordinarily worried about their survival, but they will anyway. But yeah, I'm going to have Cecil take care of what healing we need here without going back to like rest up in bed or anything like that. Let's see, I think we're good to go. So yeah, we could get the rest of the treasure in the castle, but I'll just do that off screen in this version of the game anyway. But in any case, 
Hey, how's it going? Where'd all your soldiers go? Oh. What do you mean? Uh-oh. Well, the music cut out. You know what that means. Well, I thought I... Yeah, I thought I was talking to you. Oh. What, did you guys have tryouts or something? Maybe. I mean, they are kind of demons and such. Whoa! Kanazo? You have something to do with Kane? No, they just translated it a little differently here. For boss time against Kanazo. Okay, so. Start here. Pretty similar there. But the thing is, is that because I can't skip to Tela's turn, I'm not going to be able to get Ice 3 cast before Kanazo raises up his water or gathers the water there. So what I want to do is have Palum cast Lit 1, which is a much faster spell than Ice 3, so that way he can dispel the barrier or remove it or scare him, I guess. And then Tela can get in Ice 3. Another thing you could do is have Tela cast Lit 3 from the very start, and you might be able to get that to go through before he uses his Tsunami, Tidal Wave, Big Wave, whatever they call it in this translation. And yeah, when, the, when he's gathered the water, he's weak to lightning. So you could use that instead against him. But well, yeah, I just wanted to show you a little mechanic there. But yeah, most versions of the game, he's pretty easy there. But where do we go first with our new airship? Find out next time and let's play Final Fantasy IV Pixel. This is H.G. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day!